Join us this week as we show you a day in the life of the Elnick boys, Northern Territory style. Hello people. You pull that one in. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> I We're ready for bed. We've had a rod go overboard, thanks to you, Finny. I'm still dirty at you. <laughs> it's a day in the life of the Elnick boys. No! <laughs> Finny. Today, we're showing everyone what you guys get up to. And a day travelling in the Northern Territory. Woohoo! Yeah, clap, Fiddy! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> what do we do next? Hungry! You're hungry? What do you want? It's Big Big. You want Wheat Big? With what? It's Mom. Jam. The boys normally put us through our paces in the morning routine. It must be such a hassle getting dressed and brushing your teeth. Release the hounds! Vinny, are you going? <laughs> put these on the table. You're welcome. Our oldest son, Lennox, loves making breakfast at the moment. And our littlest boy, Finny, loves eating it. <laughs> so, as the boys have breakfast, I just, um, we'll tell you what we're doing. We're doing a life of the boys in a day, or a day in the life of the boys. <laughs> but yeah. where are we? So, we're at 7 Emu Station um, in the outback, Queensland. Oh, no, NT now. Northern Territory, yep. Um, so, yeah, we're just going to show you, we're going to do a few for you, just to show you the life that they live. Yeah, and this week um, we're at a remote location next to a river. We can do some fishing, crabbing, fires, all that sort of thing. So we'll show you what the boys get up to when we're in a place like this. Good boy. Clever boy, high five. <laughs> so we love a cuppa in the morning. Come on, Lennox, let's fill the billy up. Ready? There's one thing about our boys, is they're into absolutely everything. And where there is one, Not the anything. other is never too far away. I got a grab up. Oh, thank you. you. Can I have a kiss? Thank you so much. It's extremely rare that Lennox sits for any amount of time, but today he finished a whole cuppa then went crazy with his toys. Oh no! Alright, so the boys normally have a little play after brekkie. Nick and I just have our cuppers and attempt to get some peace just for two minutes. Um, but then normally in the mornings we do go out, do some fishing or go out on a little adventure. However, this morning Finny's changed it up, he's very, very tired. So we thought we can't get liveies at the moment, so we may as well just wait till this afternoon. So Finny's in bed and um, Lennox wants to do some cooking. That's all right, that's okay. Next, is this the best part? Yeah. Oh, are you going to put it in? You can put it in. Don't that to help. Oh, Dad, do it. <laughs> Should put the lid on top, Lennox. No. Yeah. What does Daddy do? Put some cold on top, don't we? Saying not too hot, Dad. Not too hot. Not too hot. Alright. Bye bye. See you later. Are you going to work? Yes. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. See you later. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, you burnt it. <laughs> Do you want to show the camera your, your cake? As Lennox's cake. Good boy, mate. Why aren't you sleeping? <laughs> Nap time is hit and miss with this little fella. So we got out the learning cards and activity books, which doesn't last too long with these two. They are just too active. The tractors. So another thing that boys are pretty lucky to um, be able to do is go fishing and crabbing in some of some remote places. If you're new to the channel, we carry a boat on our travels on top of the car. So it allows us to get out and do some fishing, eh boys? Yeah. And some crabbing. It took and about half an hour to get on this boat by the way. <laughs> yeah, it took a bit to get ready, sunscreen, all the rest. But Lennox, are we going to go pull the crab pots? Yes. And uh, Finny takes a liking to the motor. He's always trying to start it and go, Brrrr, aren't you, big dog? No, no. <laughs> yeah? You might be able to drive with Dad. Oh, hey, Lennox is revving up. Okay, can we see our crab boys? Yes. There, where are we going? There. How many did we get? Three. No look. Um, Five. Good boy. It's a There's a couple of good ones in there too, Lenny. So show people. An um, itchel. Oh, he fits Nui. Look, he's bigger than that. See, a lot bigger. Fun? Hi. <laughs> yeah, good job, Nui. Cross it over that one. Yeah. Through it. Yeah, pull that one, Nui. Cross it over. And then you pull that one side you've got. Ready, steady. Uh, pull. Good job. And it's done, Lennox. Look. You tied a crab. Do you want to hold him? <gasps> Good boy. Is he heavy? Uh, I'm going to give you the full weight of him. You got Nui. him? Good boy, Lenny. Oh. Look at Mum. You got the big crabby. Yes. Good boy. Woohoo. Do you want to cook him up later? Yes. Will we put him in the esky? That's um, Lennox's first actual time holding a crab. He's been too scared. That was good. Good boy. One more. One more. We only took one. We got another crab, but uh, I decided to drop this one and uh, just to see if everyone was on their toes. That's what uh, crabbing with kids looks like. No. These too small. Um, that long I'm off. <sighs> that Holy. Long I'm off. It did come off, didn't it? We try to include our boys in everything we do, whether it be cooking, driving the boat, crabbing, and just everyday life. They learn so much on the road. fishing spot um, we did catch some here previously so fingers crossed we can catch some more but this time Lennox wants to go I'm gonna catch a big one do you want me dad to cast it out for you and then you can hold on to it go yeah. Lennox <sighs> go on baby boy go yeah. keep winding keep winding there it is mum it might jump holy that Lennox, that's a huge fish. Oh, Woo! Keep, keep winding. Yeah. Go, Lennox. Keep winding. Quick. Oh. Can you see him? Can you see him? Oh. All right, you hold the rod. Oh. Woo! <laughs> Look what you just caught. Lennox. Go and stand with Daddy. Go and stand with Dad so Mummy can get a picture. <laughs> oh, Lennox, you just caught that. Look, Dad got him. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him wiggling. Go crazy. 
Did you pull that one in? Yeah. Good job! <laughs> I'm wow. Put it in the water. Put it in the water. Yeah. Was that fun? Yeah. Ready? We'll let him go. Ready, steady. Ah, uh, bye, Fishy. <laughs> Good boy. Do you want to high five, Daddy? Yeah. High five. <laughs> Did you stinky? I washed him. Daddy, put him in the water. Yeah. Do you want to catch another one? Too big and icy. <laughs> <laughs> the boys were lucky to get onto a few fish that day, and Finley, the good fella he is, chucked one of Dad's fishing rods over. All right, we've caught a fish, few fish. The boys have caught a few fish. We've had a rod go overboard. My, my um, brand new rod, actually. Thanks to you, Finny. We did get it back, so it might have to have a freshwater bath, but. Everyone's cold, tired, hungry. This is how it normally ends up. <laughs> anyway, we're going to go back and maybe cook the crab up. We're going to get the pots out because we're leaving this spot tomorrow. Let's go. In control of the winch, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Um, We're uh, dragging the boat up because there's this big uh, bank in the road. <laughs> now I know they probably won't remember it, but teaching kids even like stuff to do this is pretty cool. Go, hey, Finny! Hopefully one day the boys are old enough to just do this, and uh, we can sit back in the chairs and just watch. Press the button. <laughs> Press the button, boy. Oh, wait, there's a snake just here, eh? Really? Yeah. Can't have a look, in a hole. So, we're just getting the boat up, and look at this. There's a snake in the bank. I don't know if you can see that. And uh, I'm not the one messing with snakes, eh? I don't, any. Any snake, I think, can be venomous. This goes to show away, um, like, you know, if we got bitten by that, we're pretty well, we're in a chopper and we're out of here, I think. But, um, well, yeah, be I careful. Think... So Lennox helped me get the boat off the other day, and Finny is going to help me get the boat back on while Lennox is sleeping today. You a whistle bowler, old buddy? You in trouble? When I say the kids are going to help, they don't really. They sort of make it harder than it has to be. Would you agree, Lenya? Yeah. With everything. <laughs> Boys are littering non-stop all day. What are you drawing? A doll in bed. So a good way to keep them occupied is helping with some everyday camp jobs and cooking some tea. Thank you. It's a good thing when you got to clean the esky, eh, but it means you've caught something. <laughs> Cleaning up and the crabs have gone rogue. <laughs> we didn't tie these two. And they've, uh, a uh, pretty big part of the boys, like if they catch it, they got to cook it and eat it. So, do you want to put these in? Yeah, that's it. Good we can job. dangle them in. You've got to be careful though, it's hot water. Yeah. Dangle Good them boy, in. Lennox. Woo Do you want to do another one? Uh, Finny here, this way. You alright? Finny, ah, 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 And 18 minutes, Lennox. 18 minutes, we've got to set our timer, and they should be done. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> and the other one, you've got to keep an eye on him. He's walking now, so he thinks he's unstoppable. Yeah, can you say Nunu mangrove, and Daddy. mangrove jack? This is Lennox's first catch and cook where he done it all. The one cut in here. And of course, Finley was there to eat it. Ooh. And keep going. Num, num. <laughs> Good job. Good 
Good job. And now you're gonna cook it? Are you gonna cook that? So you can say you've caught it. You've caught it. You've filleted it. Filleted it. And you've skinned it. Skinned it. And you've cooked it. Cooked it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll have that. <laughs> Oh, maybe we'll just place them, eh? You won't burn yourself, baby. Thanks for the grass, Vinny. Thanks. Do you want me to do it? Then you can move them around. In a minute, we'll flip it over. Okay, we're doing it again. You alright? Good job. Good boy. Good work. <laughs> Maybe this? <laughs> so around this time, at about 5.30, 6 o'clock, the boys start to crack it, um, which is what we're starting to see now. So we've, as you can see, Lennox has put his fish on, so they're going to have dinner early and we'll have dinner later. Um, we don't really have much of a routine, as you can see. Um, each day is totally different. Um, the only sort of routine is night time, and that's really sort of. It depends where we are, what we're doing. Um, but around 6, 6.30, the boys head inside and um, have a shower so they stay dirty for the whole day because there's no point cleaning them up. And, um, yeah, then maybe watch a movie, read a book. Um, yeah, and then bedtime for them. But, yeah, we'll, we'll feed them up and see how we go. How is it? <laughs> Good? Any yum, yum. <laughs> oh. We're ready for bed. Yum, yum. Nom, nom. <laughs> All right, I think, <laughs> I think we've cracked it. Big fella wanted a claw, so we got him one, eh? And then you just go. Oh. That's it. Hot? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Big Mama couldn't help herself, her favourite bits of claw. Especially when it's nice and warm. Well, she's seen Lennox have one, you had to get in there, didn't you? Mm. You've had a bit of a seafood feast there, Lennox. <laughs> Look how messy your table is. <laughs> yeah, I know, crab gets pretty messy. Finny's trying to eat the crab shell. Mm. You eat everything, nothing's going to waste, Finn. Mm. <laughs> That's the sound <laughs> of bath time. <tone. laughs> And two little babies! Fresh, fresh, fresh! Freshy, freshy, freshy! You pick movies, don't you? You get to watch it on Mummy and Daddy's bed. Peppa Pig! So that's pretty well how a day in a spot like this goes for us. Um, yep. It's not over yet though. <laughs> We yeah. still have to tackle the one-year-old to sleep. <laughs> yeah, you can, might be able to hear him in the background. He's screaming still. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, all days aren't like that. That was a pretty good day. There wasn't too many tantrums or anything like that. Yeah. Um, and like I said, every day is totally different depending where you are, what you're doing. And if it's a traveling day, it's a totally different day. So, but other than that. <laughs> yeah, this is like the 10 minutes of peace we get before we have to pack up all their crud. Yeah. <laughs> the hurricanes. Yeah. Cool. But um, look, we try and get to places like this because, I mean, you can sit here watching the sunset with this. Yeah, the boys learn yeah. a lot on the road. We absolutely love travelling with them. It's yeah. been really good for them. And yeah. great while they're young. <laughs> it's good to teach them. I mean, Lennox fishing, crabbing, all those sort of things that probably not normally, um, Yeah. Um, you know. Even well, though it's hard some days, 24-7 with them, <laughs> yeah. um, it's totally worth it. Quality yeah. time, we get to spend time together, Yeah. watch them grow up. That's right, and hopefully that's given you a little bit of an insight into sort of our everyday to day sort of workings, I guess. Yeah. If you don't follow us already, guys, we do do weekly episodes of our trip around Australia with the boys, and yeah, that's a whole... Whole nother thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we're going to leave you here. So um, if you haven't yet, subscribe. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. It helps us out. If you want to leave a comment, that'd be awesome. But we'll see you on the next one. Cheers. Thanks see you for guys. watching.